Hi, I'm Zerfall. I'm the Mysterious GG. And we're uh, about to open some chests. As part of Let's Play King's Quest 2. Oh, I actually had some bodies here. I was gonna... Let me just get back to the game, though. What? What? Uh, nothing. <laughs> I actually have some bodies here, but... On my chest. Ooh, he trembles a lot. He's so excited about keys, and he, he's thinking about the other things this would represent in older movies. It's going to get really good when he meets the queen. He's going to do a lot of trembling, especially <laughs> when they go down to that dungeon. The old chest is now unlocked. So is the old queen's chest. Apparently, he never looks in this chest. Ah, Zerf, they did that just to make you look bad. Looking into the... Or, oh, wait, did you type something in so fast I didn't see it? What? Uh, did I... you actually... Did it, did it popped up by itself, didn't it? Or did you just type it in and I have a lag and I didn't see uh, no, I typed in open chest. Oh, okay. No, but look in chest. Oh, no, I didn't look in. It just decided I was saying. doing it. It was, like, it was like, you know what? He's making fun of us. We're not making him look in. Boom. It's one time. <laughs> one time we're going to do it. Diamond and Sapphire Tiara. So you're going to go up to the queen dressed like Liberace and be like, honey, you're never going to look as good as me. It's empty. You got the tiara. I was just making sure there's nothing laying on the bottom. <laughs> this is moon crystal magic time. I don't want this to change there we go this is the worst part right here they literally give you like a pixel to walk on yep like now i said we're, now yeah. we're not doing too bad i think the first i think the first time we went up there and found out it was an optional treasure uh and got back down alive i don't think in any subsequent playthrough we ever actually attempted to climb those stairs not until after we figured out that you can save and load <laughs> but but it's not an opt optimal playthrough i'm curious about this though is there something behind that i always thought there w there was uh, it really looks like it should be a uh, secret passage back there, but... Although, if you look at the castle, it's not really that big. And we don't have enough points left to get. <laughs> I yeah, feel that's like true. we're going to get the last few points on this new area. Although, some of these earlier games, actually, the maximum points were higher than the... Uh, than the uh, amount you could get. Don't pay the ferryman. Don't even say it up front. All right, so off to the door, I guess, eh? Off to the door. Can't think of uh, anything else to do. I mean, you know, I've enjoyed our time together as our fall, but when we open that third door, we win the game. It's over. That's the very end. There's no, uh, there's no, you have to. No, I'm trying to, like, build up this. I'm, I'm assuming, make, I'm assuming you have to seduce the, the queen I'm trying somehow. to make it suspenseful and exciting when we open the door and there's still more adventure to go. But well, right. there's, there's, there's got to be the quartz tower that we saw. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Um,. Unless the Quartz Tower just looked a lot nicer uh, on the mirror, and it was actually the Vampire Castle. <laughs> She's actually behind the uh, the bookshelf, and we just left her there. Now the Quartz the Quartz Tower has like the last best chance to be killed, even though you know all the puzzle solutions in the game. Which is uh... okay. So here's another thing, folks, that you didn't get to see. Uh, very frustrating. You're playing on hardcore. This bridge will collapse if you cross it too many times. Yep. So just for funsies, since you saved, why don't you do that? I don't know if you have to leave the screen to do it again. I think, you, I think you do. Just imagine, folks, you've been playing around. You have no idea what's going on, so you, you Oh, dear. That. Oh, my. Oh, my, my. Oh, hell, yes. You have fallen to your death, by the way. Yep. Too many, too many crossing attempts there, so... That's what happens when you don't check your wife's medication. Yeah, so I think the there's... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So luckily it was saved. So you I'm have just, the exact right amount to get across. That's how yeah, the game exactly. screws you over. Yep. You get confused, you're lost, you're like, what was that clue again? I'm going to go back and read it one more time. This game's an ass. <laughs> no, too bad. Now, a lot of my memories of how frustrating this game are came from having played it when we we, didn't, we couldn't get save load to work because we were working on a computer that didn't really have a hard drive. It was like A drive, B drive, and it was a lot more complicated than it is now. But I'm now thinking how hard would Police Quest have been under the same conditions? <laughs> Oh, man. The, the key to the third door fits easily into the keyhole. You turn it and presto. Sexy. Because you're, again, thinking about what this would represent in an old movie. <laughs> and again, the key disappears, revealing a world unlike any you've ever seen before. And now he appears in, like, the real modern world. And it's like, whoa. No, he's on planet Namek. <laughs> yeah. So I don't know if we should go up or down. I'm going to go down first. There's rocks. We'll go up. Get your rocks off. 
I wonder if this this planet actually seems a lot more curved than the last one, so maybe it's even smaller. I'm pretty sure it's tiny. Uh, try that looks suspicious. In, try walking into the... I think that's a net. But uh, walk into the waterfall, I think that's an interesting new way to die. And I'm pretty sure we can't get here without all the items we need to win. Oh, off to sea. Wait, can I swim? You fall into the swift water... I don't Sorry. think you can swim in that water, actually. We're gonna we're gonna go through that again so you can read that when we die. And uh, I can try to swim by hitting the correct key. You actually have to try pretty hard to It's very the iridescent ocean is very turbulent. You cannot swim in it. So yeah, you're screwed. You fall onto the swift water where you're washed out to a sea where you drown. And Neptune takes a minute to like <laughs> skull fuck your corpse. <laughs> Taking back his trident and stabbing you in the face with it. Whoops. Let's just play the whole game again, why not? So, I had fun. some sort of net? I believe it is a net, and I believe we have to try to fish with the net. Once you figure out that that's a net, uh, what you have to do is fairly simple. I guess you just cast net. Destination into the wild sea. Upon retrieving it, you see you have caught a large golden fish. It falls from the net and flops helplessly on the beach. Oh, it's probably a magic fish. Well, it's magic carp. Gasping fish is unable to utter a sound. You know what you do with magic fish, right? You grab the flopping fish. Its mouth is wide open and its gills are extended. With difficulty, you hold the fish as it twists and it turns in your hands. We can just keep the fish for the rest of the game. Although we won't get anywhere. Good idea. You throw the four fish against the rocks. Like an ass. And it lands on the ground. No. Of course not. You saved it. Because you're a nice guy. Yep. Now we can talk to him because he has uh, water air to breathe. The golden fish calls out to you. Come, come. Right on my back. I can help you. So we're going we're gonna to take the wild fish ride. Check this that looks show. pretty nauseating. I'm leaving you on another beach where you can die. Fish, come back. How the hell am I supposed to get out of here? Oh, a it glint can... of metal catches your eye. You look towards the direction of the right direction. <laughs> and you see an amulet lying on the ground. Beep, beep, beep. Okay, I like how he's just very willing to grab anything. It's an amulet of the stars, plus one to all attributes. Well, there's the quartz tower. Yeah, your my image is just a second or two behind yours, so I'm like, I'll take your word for it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I'm just trying to wander around the rest of the island first. You don't want to miss out on anything. Although we only need to get 20 more points. The, print, the queen herself has got to be worth 15 points, right? I mean, I don't know. Maybe she's only a 10. Which actually sounds pretty good. I hope you have another magic sugar cube for additional magical stuff that kills you at the gate. So there is another island floating off in the distance here, but I don't think we can swim over to it. I'm pretty sure it's a death trap, yeah. It's a trap. <laughs> Even if you get there, it's like an ant lion that just like kills you. Right, yeah, Admiral like Akbar is uh... actually over there waving invitingly, but it's, it's a trap. <laughs> Oh, I'll join the Rebel Alliance. Oh, well, let's, let's... Oh, over here. I can help you. Oh. <laughs> oh, if I'm not transformed, it's some kind of monster. Oh, oh Gobi. Hmm. <laughs> oh, I'll be right there. To kill you with my spear. Oh, this must be uh, Bobo's Palace or Casa de Bobo or whatever the hell we were talking about, Diablo. <laughs> I'll come right there to kill you with my spear. No, oh, they switch the freaking view on you. You're walking to the right and suddenly you have to walk left again. Yep, this is like like I said, when you're playing on hardcore mode, this is some nerve-wracking shit. Be careful, there's a huge lion with dripping fangs at the top of the stairs. He has a hungry look in his eyes. In his eye. You only one of Alright, let's save this. Remove thorn from lion's paw. <laughs> let's just walk over there. Nope! Crunch, snarl, chomp. Well, you made for a nice meal for the hungry lion. Smack, slurp. He likes his king's hot and spicy chomp. 
So let's see what we got. Examine pod. Look for. Uh... <laughs> It, it's, it's surely it's not that easy. No, it's not. I think well, we have this sword that we've never used. It's the biggest line you have ever seen. He could eat you with two bites of his powerful jaws, his tail thumps repeatedly. <laughs> with one mighty heave of your sword, you fatally wound the innocent lion who was just hungry. He slumped to the floor. How many points you get for that? Two points. I want to try something else though here. When you mention that. Oh, so many more points. Oh wow, good for you, Zerf. Well, I was the one who got all judgmental, but it never occurred to me there was a nice way to do it. <laughs> now you can kill him in his sleep and get even more points. You have found her, the girl from the magic mirror. She is even more beautiful than you had imagined. She has far more pixels to her face than you thought at first. <laughs> Oh, look at her daintily hold her dress up. Take a look at my good stuff. Oh, can't do that. Yes! My name is Valance. What's yours? Oh, we should try, uh... Avatar. <laughs> Aw. Oh, Grant, I am forever grateful to you. Well, at least for the next couple of minutes. So, um, you got, That's pretty good. got a plan how to get out of here, or, uh, <laughs> this is no time for small talk. Hmm. I guess we gotta take her downstairs. Oh, maybe. Does she come with us? No, it doesn't look like it. And we locked the door again behind us, too. <laughs> we were like, you the line coming in. Well, you the found line her again. She's even more beautiful than you had imagined. Or remember, from 30 seconds ago. I was hoping to maybe score some extra points there. Trying to break Giving her my name twice. Oh, I guess we do have to give her stuff, don't we? That's probably how we... Well, you could say, like, woman call my follow me. Does this have that text parsing thing? That some of the later games you could... You can't do that. It would, I think it used to be... Well, no, I'm thinking of the Infocom games. It would be woman, comma, and then whatever you wanted to tell her. You can't do that. I have to give it to woman, I guess. Give her the cloak. <laughs> not right now. Not in town. Grab Valeria's hand. Don't be so rough. Val Valanis is very grateful to you for rescuing her. She will follow you anywhere except, of course, down those dreadful stairs. She is deathly afraid of them. Well, wow. Alright, alright. So what do we got to do then? Hmm. Well, unfortunately, while poking around the hint book without meaning to, I, I found the like one of the last things you have to do. But I haven't come across. I've been waiting for it to show up. This object you need, and it hasn't. So I'm wondering if we just missed it somewhere. Maybe it's is it supposed to be on the last island here? I think so. I'm. Pretty, I hope so. I uh, yeah. It's, I, I do too. That would be why we used multiple saves, though. Oh. Well, there's the fast way down. Instantly killed. I think you were a little high up for that to be a shortcut. I wasn't trying to use I, it. I know, I know. <laughs> have, you, have we looked at her to see if she's maybe carrying anything? She has magic lion defeating spray. The most beautiful girl in the world. Even more lovely than her appearance in the mirror. Her long auburn hair tumbles in luscious waves down her back. She has the bluest eyes you've ever seen. And soft, creamy skin. Maybe she could let down her hair. Well, I mean, that's kind of what they're going for here, isn't it? I suppose. Oh, what's your name? Let me just put... It doesn't know what Zerpo is. <laughs> they all say their name, John. I'm not <laughs> sweet cheeks, my feet. You can tell me your real name. <laughs> Okay, so down your hair. Nope. Let down your lady hair. All right, well, let's try to make it back down without... 
causing death. They change the direction very quickly. What is my major muffler? This restore. Okay, let's just. Or do you think we have to talk to her first before we get this last thing? Uh. You know what? There is um. There's there's okay. I I figured out what it is. We have to actually uh, look at your inventory. We have to. We should probably be examining everything that we acquire uh, after unlocking the third door. And I can only think of one thing that we actually found that we got to keep, but I don't think we actually looked at it. No, the amulet. Oh, nice. I can walk around while sliding. <laughs> you can, like, roll around like Samus and Metroid. Examine the amulet as made of bronze and has tarnished with age. A tiger's eye stone is embedded into the front. You turn the it over and see the word home on the back. I'm glad you got that before I hit enter because I hit it before you stopped talking. Oh. So say home. Just type Should I say it right now? Yeah, because we'll probably lose the game, but I'm curious to see how. No, that's fine because I can actually restore where we were because we actually had it there. You remember the word home. A tingling sensation develops your body. You black out for a second. When you come to, you see or somewhere else. But oh, and I can't even... I can't even choose not to do it. It's unfortunate that you have returned to Daventry without a bride. Because, again, Daventry has no eligible bachelorettes. Oh, apparently this is the uh, the bad ending. The sad ending. Yes. Aww. This is like when you agree to... Oh, see, it's a sad ending because Emo helped. <laughs> it's all his fault. <laughs> At least Elmo didn't help. This and soul helped. He's uh, from the soul system. No, yeah. If you go back with that, this is like when you answer yes to the guy who asks you if you want to join his evil cause right at the end of an RPG. Mm -hmm. And it's not even gonna let you restore now. Come on, game. It will if I type it. I also, but I can't um, type during the actual credit parts. I think we're supposed to kiss uh, Valeria for point for maximum for, points. For points, yeah. You gotta lay one on her. You can't just take her back. It just keeps going in a circle there. You've got uh, to, do, if we if we uh, order the lobster and kiss her three times, does something else happen? I don't know, but you're both in ecstasy, so apparently uh, in Sierra Land, you don't need uh, any of the other, you know, different parts. You just the kiss is good enough. Well, it was worth playing the game just for this scene. I guess so. You'll have to tell me. Safe, sane, consensual. Take her down to the dungeon. I just wanted to make sure I had that out of the way. Okay, so... Home? And how many points do we get for that? You remember the word home. A tingling sensation develops your body. Damn it! We don't have the full points! Congratulations, King Graham. You have won the hand of beautiful Valeria. May the two of you live happily ever after. I would like to point out that... Um... The evil wizard, the gnome, are both in the audience. Yeah, and apparently our home is now the, the church in the world that neither of us lived in. Well, I mean, I suppose you went home and then you went to church afterwards and we cut some stuff out. But no, we don't have the full points. What the f heck? <laughs> Does the scene do anything? Neptune's there. What's that fucker think he gets to come to your wedding for? Asshole. And Graham's shifting back and forth on his feet as I touch these keys. It makes him do a little dance. Make it a love, get down tonight. Maybe we get points for this sort of stuff. Oh, you got blessed. Now you won't be killed by the hag on your way back to Daventry. <laughs> Maybe now we get the points after the door's closed. Oh, if you enjoyed this uh, game, please ask your dealer for about the ability, uh, the availability of... Leather Magic Goddesses of Phobos. No, wait, that's a different <laughs> series. To air is human. To really foul things up takes a computer. Wow, very clever. All right, well, <laughs> there you go. That, that that actually went a lot faster than I was expecting it to. Yeah. Uh, but I want to go check and see uh, what points we missed. They do have quite a few guides down there that are just maximum point guides that literally just say, do this, get points. They don't have any uh, did locations you, and stuff like that. Did you kill Dracula? Avoid giving away any treasures. Did you find the brooch in the hole in the tree? Did mm -hmm. you find the bracelet under the shell on the beach? Did yep. you find the tiara chest in, in Dracula's tower? Yep. Did you find the necklace in the hollow log? Did you find the earrings yep. in the chest in the dwarf's house? 
Yep. That's all. Well, fuck. I guess we lost points because um, it, it knows we used a hint book. <laughs> maybe. But we lo- we're missing like... Maybe you can kiss her more than one time. I don't know about that. We're, <laughs> we're missing like eight points, though. That's like not like one little treasure's worth of stuff because we only got like ten points for actually rescuing the freaking queen. I told you she was just a ten. <sighs> yep. On a scale of one to fifteen. She goes up to eleven. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I guess that's the end of King's Quest. I guess so. King's Quest 2. Or, um, Sons of the Patriots. Or uh, was <laughs> King's Quest 2. It's like uh, Sons of Liberty. I'm sorry. King's Quest 4 is uh, Guns of the Patriots. That's right. So that's cool. Um, and now uh, you'll have to spoil it for Clinch. Whenever you and he get back together, you can tell him. Um, yeah, he, he took too long. He took too long. Quest 1. And uh, the King Graham got married without becoming the king first. So he's just Graham. Maybe he became king because he married Queen. Yeah, that would help. Uh, it, g- it gives his uh, claim to the throne some more legitimacy than I found a mirror and some other stuff. He's like Queen's consort, so that's still pretty. He's like the Duke of Edinburgh, Graham, so that's good for him. Yeah, that's kind of sexist, though, if you think about it. Oh, the, because... what, the, the monarchy is like rooted in old-fashioned, non-progressive ideas? Well, like, what are you saying? <laughs> no, no, because they recently changed it so that, I, and not being from a Commonwealth country anymore, um, Americans might not know this, but you can actually, they've changed the law in England so that if a woman is, if a girl is born first before a boy, the boy doesn't get to become king, the woman becomes queen. Right. To make it less sexist. It needs to be. But bad. if you marry into the royal family as a man, you still don't get to become king, no matter what. Well, no, because you're not uh, you're descended from royalty. You can't marry in. I have a lot more problem with the fact yeah, that if you, marry, if you marry a Catholic, you are uh, out of the royal family. That bugs me a little bit more than some of the other stuff you've mentioned. But like you said, enough. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I guess that's the end of this game. I'm Zerfall. I'm Sirius JG, and that was a lot of fun. we got to do this again sometime. Yeah, sounds good. I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye-bye.